Good, Good morning, morning Cougars. Cougars. Welcome back to another episode of Oakton On Air. I'm Cooper. And I'm Amir. As we approach the end of the season for our fall sports, last Friday, we recognized the seniors for football, cross country, band, cheer, dance, golf, and color guard. Our volleyball and field hockey teams had their own separate senior nights this year. Let's head into Liesl, attend the senior night recognition ceremony. Thank you, Cooper. Hi, it's Liesl and Oakton On Air, and I'm here at senior night. As you can see behind me, the energy here is super lively. People here are so hyped up to see their favorite seniors come through and their families are here to support them. Back to the studio. Hey Amir, how did you like senior night? It was fun seeing all the students supporting the seniors and Football got their first district win in seven years. Moving into academics, the center hosted their first tutorathon last week and had a great turnout. Let's go to Ash, who was there to see how they ran it. This is Ash from Oakton on Air, and I'm with Christopher Wang, who is the head manager of the center. What do you like best about tutoring? Uh, I really like working with all sorts of different students and tutoring the different subjects. I think it's especially rewarding when students truly start to begin to understand the subjects through tutoring and they see their results through their improved test scores. What is beneficial about this tutoring session? I think that what's beneficial is that they have a lot of tutors available um, right on hand and that they tutor a variety of subjects like chemistry or math or anything you need help with. How do you rate the tutors? Very a good five out of five, you know, everyone's really smart and always there for you and has a good passion for tutoring. Recently, Oakton hosted Candidates Day. Several candidates and representatives came to answer questions posed by our seniors who were required to attend. This event has been held at Oakton annually for nearly 30 years and is unique to our school. Liesl, TJ, and Ash spoke to Jerry Connolly's Chief of Staff and Challenger, Mike Van Meter. Hi, I'm Liesl with Oakton On Air. How interesting have the questions been from students? These students have done an amazing job. The questions are so smart and so on such a diverse set of topics. I've been super impressed. You guys are doing great work. You are so much smarter than when I was in high school. <laughs> and what is the benefit of your campaign coming to Oakton? Getting you all engaged as young people before this important election, Democrat or Republican or Independent, is very important as well as how can you get involved in campaigns. How important is it to engage high school students who are just love to vote? One of the things I noticed that when I go to meetings, my, my own party meetings, is everyone's about my age or older. We don't see a whole lot of young people coming to the meetings. And I think this is the future. And all the students here in the school are the future of our government. And we need to engage more folks. And, and, I, and I will, I'll call out my own party. I don't think the Republican Party is very good at it. I think the Democrats are much better at it than we are. But I'm committed to doing things like that. That's why I came here today. In addition to Candace Day, Oakton set up a booth where seniors who will be 18 by the election can register to vote. Let's hear from Lisa about this opportunity. How do you feel about registering? Pretty good. I think voting's pretty important, so I'm excited to be able to vote. Okay. Um, are you actually going to vote? Um, not in November, because I won't be 18 yet, but I pre-registered, so I'll vote next year. That's it for this week. Have, Have a, a great, great weekend, weekend Cougars. Cougars. Rawr.